Today's video, I'm gonna be cold calling 50 real estate agents in the Windsor area in hopes of booking some meetings, and I'm gonna break down these calls for you guys and show you exactly how we do a cold calling. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, if you're new, I appreciate you being here. Before I get into the video and start doing some cold calls, make sure you subscribe, like, and turn on your post notifications. Uh, if you're a returning subscriber, I appreciate you watching. Uh, in today's video, like I said in the intro, I'm gonna go and do some cold calls. So I'm gonna be cold calling agents from the Windsor area using uh, the script that we have. So uh, if you're curious on how we do our outreach or how the cold calls go, I'll break down some of the calls, uh, show you guys some of the rebuttals I get hit with and how I answer them. So. Uh, I'll jump right into it and start going through the list. I'm sure I'll have to fast forward some. Uh, as a lot of people don't answer, it is Saturday, so uh, we'll see, but I'll skip it all to the good parts of the video. So basically what I'm doing is I have an Excel sheet of 100 people that I'm gonna call. Uh, when they don't answer, I just highlight it as yellow. If I book a meeting, I highlight it as green. Uh, if they do answer and they say no, I'll highlight them as red. And if I get like an email uh, or a call back, I highlight it as purple. So uh, that's basically what you'll see me doing right now. Hi, uh, is this Al? No, I don't think uh, Maybe get the wrong number. Oh, okay. It's my Yeah, okay. No problem. Sorry. Okay. I think I honestly just pronounced that guy's name wrong. Hello? Hi, uh, is this Roger? How about it? Yeah, okay. Hello? Hi, uh, is this Roger? Hey, Roger, this is Carter. How's it going? Hello, who's here again? Uh, my name's Carter. I'm actually just calling you on behalf of Versatile Agency. We're a marketing agency that specializes in real estate, and we're just looking to work with some new agents in the 2022 year. Uh, based well, I, I, I wish all the luck finding some, but I, I'm not interested. Yeah, it's all good, Roger. I appreciate your time. Okay, thanks. You have a good day. No problem. Have a good one. Yeah, so in that call, there's really nothing to do about that. They're just probably an older couple and they're not really interested in scaling the business and probably looking to retire. So that's something you have to look for when you're building these lists. I try to stay away from uh, super elders, but you know. Hello? Hi, is this Simon? Yeah, okay. Hi, my name's Carter. How's it going? That's good. I'm just calling you on behalf of Versatile Agency. We're a marketing agency that specializes in real estate. And we're just looking to uh, work with some new agents in the 2022 year. Basically what we do for our current agents is bring them high quality buyer and seller leads guaranteed. So we were just calling you to see if you'd be open to getting on a quick Zoom call sometime next week to discuss uh, our strategy and how we could be of value to your business. Yeah, so basically uh, we specialize in real estate. We're, we do social media advertising on Instagram and Facebook. And um, oh, to briefly okay. explain it, we bring high quality buyer and seller leads to our agents. Okay, I get you. Yeah, I'll, uh, next week we'll do... Yeah, can you do Tuesday? Um, uh, let's do it Thursday. Thursday? At one. Yeah, I can do Thursday, one that works for me. What's the, the best email to reach you at? Awesome, sounds good, Amon. I'll, I'll book you in and looking forward to speaking with you. Okay, thank you. Thank Have a good one. So there you go, there's one meeting in round seven calls. So, I mean, it's a numbers game and when you're doing cold calling, the more calls you get, I mean, it, it's super, it's super random. Uh, sometimes you'll have good days, sometimes you'll have bad days, but throughout this list already, I had some calls before actually getting on here and we already have three meetings from doing like 22 calls, so not including that one, but um, that's kind of the pitch that I use. It, it varies every time, every call is different. All depends on the, the questions that I get asked as well, so I'm just gonna go ahead and, and book this girl in. Hey Randy, my name's Carter. How's it going? Hey, good night, Carter. That's good. I'm doing pretty good. I'm just calling you on behalf of Versatile Agency. We're a marketing agency that specializes in real estate. And we're just looking to work with 
uh, some new agents in the 2022 year. Basically what we do for our current agents is bring them high quality buyer and seller leads guaranteed. So we were just calling to see if you'd be interested in getting on a quick Zoom call sometime next week to discuss our strategy and how we could be of value to you and your business. I'm honestly not too sure because I've had a couple of agents reach out to me like this. Yeah. And uh, things have gone south, so I, I prefer to uh, look over things via email if you have any information that way. Okay. Yeah, for sure. What's yeah, the... yeah, for sure. I could send you an email with some information. You can go over it and you can go from there. Yeah, because I buy some leads and then things didn't work out, but it's the way they intended to yeah. work with me. So uh, I just want to look things through, through uh, thoroughly before we get into anything further. Yeah, yeah, 100 percent, Randy. I'll send you some information and uh, you can look it over and we can go from there. Perfect. Okay, thank you. Sounds good. No problem. Looking forward to it. No idea what I said at the end there, but. So a lot of calls will go like that. A lot of people won't want to get on a call yet. They'll just want some information via email. So I just have uh, my email pulled up and just getting ready to send them information right away. And we just have an email template script that we use when after cold calling, we get emails just to make everything super fast and I don't have to type something up every single time. Hello? Hi, is this Tina? Yeah, speaking. Hi Tina, my name's Carter, how's it going? I'm doing good. I'm just calling you on behalf of Versatile Agency. We're a marketing agency that specializes in real estate. We're just looking to work with some new agents in the 2022 year. Uh, basically what we do for our current agents is bring them high quality buyer and seller leads guaranteed. So we were just calling to see if you'd be interested in getting on a quick Zoom call sometime next week to discuss our strategy and how we could uh, help out you and your business. No, I'm good. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Have a good one, Tina. So when people are so harsh and they say, no, there's not really any rebuttals you can hit, with the, hit them with, nor do I even try to just push the sale on them because it's not even worth my time. Even if we do end up booking a meeting with them, it's probably just going to go sell. So I, I don't even try to uh, force any sort of meeting or sale upon them. Nor do I leave voicemails. I don't know, a lot of you guys are probably going to comment about why I don't leave voicemails. It's just a waste of time. Hi, is this Ginger? Yes, sir. Hey, my name's Carter. How's it going? Good, good. That's good. I'm just calling you on behalf of Versatile Agency. We're a marketing agency that specializes in real estate, and we're just looking to work with some new agents in the 2022 year. Uh, basically, what we do for our current agents is bring them high quality buyer and seller leads guaranteed. So uh, we just wanted to call you to see if you'd be interested in getting on a quick five to 10 minute Zoom call sometime next week to discuss our strategy and how we could help out your real estate career. Most Okay, it's all good. I appreciate your time. Have a good one. Well, I'm going to end it off there, guys. I did about 15 calls, got a meeting booked, I uh, got an email, got rejected a couple of times. So it just goes to show you that it's a numbers game. You know, if I did another 60 calls, probably book about three to four more meetings, uh, get some more emails. But remember when you're cold calling, it's all about being confident. And obviously, it comes with repetition. So don't be scared to pick up the phone and get rejected. Make as many calls as you possibly can every day, uh, especially at the start. The only way you're going to make money is by booking meetings and, uh, you know, doing outreach. And I find cold calling to be one of the most effective ways to book meetings. Uh, it also makes you so much better uh, doing sales. And I'm actually going to call back right now. So we'll take that. Hello? Hey, Rose, this is Carter. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm just actually calling you on behalf of Versatile Agency. We're a marketing agency that specializes in real estate and we're just looking to work with a couple new agents in the 2022 year. Uh, basically what we do for our current agents is bring them high quality buyer and seller leads guaranteed. And uh, we were just calling to see if you'd be interested in getting on a quick five to 10 minute Zoom call sometime next week to discuss our strategy and how we could be of value to you and your business.
Yeah, sure. I can send you an email, some information. You'll have my contact and then we can uh, go from there. Okay. Sounds good, Rose. Honestly, if she sounds a little old, I probably won't even send her any contact information. I mean, maybe I will, but... But yeah, like I was saying, you know, it's all about confidence and repetition. So the more calls you, you make, the better you'll get. And it also prepares you for sales calls, talking to people, uh, getting asked questions, pretty similar to what you'd be asked uh, in a live Zoom meeting. So, you know, perhaps you make you better at speaking and stuff like that. But if you if this helped you guys, comment down below, comment down below some videos that you'd like to see. Uh, make sure you subscribe. We're trying to get 2,000 subscribers by the end of 2022, which I think is very possible. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. And if you are interested, I'm doing one-on-one -on -one coaching calls just like last summer, this summer, looking for two more students. I already got three. So if you want to book a coaching call, the link will be down below in the description. And uh, peace out. We'll see you in the next one.